it, it's a different way of life altogether. It's completely a, a time capsule, really. And it's, of course, it's extremely beautiful. It's, it's a very handsome house, and it's, it's got a very peaceful, tranquil atmosphere. In the bedroom upstairs, uh, Connie's boudoir, I think there's certainly something, as far as I'm aware in that room, sometimes I'm told that temperature plummets, and that's usually an indication of something new, supernatural happening. But I fortunately have never experienced that. I came here 30 years ago, actually, and it was nothing like it is today. And over the period of time, what they've achieved, because it was in poor, very poor condition, and what they've achieved is quite, quite remarkable. My name is Robert, and I, I'm a tour guide at the castle, basically. I also serve breakfast in the mornings as well. I never tire of it. You never, t I never tire of it. My late husband and I, in 1967, we were just a young couple expecting a baby and we were sleeping in the back of a camper van because that's what you did in the 60s and we came across this castle, fell in love with it and bought it. Close to the castle, we've got a garden that's in sympathy with building but further out from the castle, the garden expresses the landscape that's around us and our place in the South Seas. The castle has been my life and of course I've got a creative passion and that's um, been released here and, and I'm so thrilled that my family are taking that passion forward into the future.